हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल टेक्नेट गाइड फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू हाउ टू इंस्टॉल काली लाइनिक्स इन ए डब्ल्यू एस क्लाउड सो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी काली लाइनिक्स इंस्टॉलेशन इन ए डब्ल्यू एस क्लाउड ओके यू कैन सी दिस इज माई ए डब्ल्यू एस मैनेजमेंट कंसोल हीयर नाउ आई हैव टू लॉग इन दिस ओके आई हैव ऑलरेडी क्रेडिट अकाउंट सो इफ यू हैव नॉट क्रिएटेड इट so i will give link in i button so you can watch from there and learn how to create account in aws okay so here you have to select root user and then type your email id gmail.com now click on next type captcha here type password now friends we have to create instance for kali linux as you can see in last video we have seen create account how to create free account okay in aws so we are going to install kali linux in free they it will not charge any cost okay because this is my free account here so we have to click here launch a virtual machine okay click here launch a virtual machine so you can see here is a linux amazon linux here so i have to select kali linux here type kali linux so we have to select here aws marketplace you can see from here kali linux free tier eligible okay it's, it will, there is no any cost here okay it's a free tier so now we have to click on select so you can see here is a charge if we will select here t2 nano micro small medium there is charge list okay so here i am going to install in free now click on continue so you can see here t2 dot micro okay i have to select free tier eligible okay t2 dot micro here now select here okay now now it's showing here t2 dot medium instance is for the best experience with this project but i have to install it free okay free tire so now click on next now it's asking how many instance you want to install so i have to select one so i have to select here network vpc okay so subnet leave it as it is default so here is a so there is no need domain directory okay so i am role is leave it as it is shut down behavior stop okay stop behavior enable hibernate no need to do enable terminate production if you will enable this protect against accidental termination suppose your uh, instance terminated accidentally so your data will be lost so you have to protect if you have, if you want to protect then you can select this option okay so i'm not going to select here so now leave it as it is now add storage click on next so you can see for linux kali linux 12 gb storage is there for free okay now click on next add tag if you want to add tag here you can add tag because uh, suppose you have a multiple machine 50 100 machine so you can add tag to identify this machine okay you can add tag here now click on configure security policy so now you can configure your security policy which source can access your machine here okay so i leave it going to leave it as it is now click on review or launch now click on launch here now friends if you want to create new create new pair okay now you can give aws security okay aws security now click on aws security key okay now click on download 
Now you can see it downloaded on your PC. Okay. Now click on launch instance. Now it's launching your instance, creating security group, authorization rule. So you can see subscription will take longer then okay. Now friends you can see our instance is still pending. It will take some time to install. Okay. Let's refresh it. Now you can see it's running. Status is running now. Okay. So my instance is running here. So what I can do? I have to connect with my Windows PC. So you can see I have downloaded this. Okay. Okay. I have downloaded this key pair. Okay. What I have to do? I have to go to CMD. Okay. Let me show you how to connect this. Click here. Okay. Now connect instance. Now how to connect? You can see here. Session manager. I have downloaded this file. This file is downloaded folder. So I have to go to CD downloads. Enter. Now I have to run this command. SSH minus I. Okay. My key pair file name. Now user then at the rate my public DNS IP address. Okay. This is my public DNS IP address. Let me show you. Where is my public DNS? This is my public DNS IP address. Okay. So I have to copy this and paste here. Now press enter. Now press Y. Yes. To continue connecting. Type yes for fingerprint. Yes. Login as Kali rather than the user root. Now it's saying that login with Kali rather than let me try. Okay. Yo, you can see I have logged in successfully here. Okay. So friends, you can see I have successfully connected with Kali OS. Okay. So so you can see this is my instance. Okay. Okay. This is my public IP address. This is my public DNS. Okay. So from here I can stop. So friend, from here I can stop this instance from stop, reboot and terminate this instance. Okay. So when you whenever you are not using this instance, you have to set to stop this because it will spend your hours. Okay. So you have to stop this instance here. So so friends, you have seen in this video how to install Kali Linux on AWS. Okay. So thanks for watching this video. Have a nice day.